Hi, so I thought I would give you a little bit of background insider look at what's going on. Um, I have spent today doing a lot of videos and content for my new online course. Um, the medicine wheel, the shamanic uh, practitioners course. So this, um, if you can see behind me here, is or on the screen here. This is the back end of, this is the admin section, the back end of, of this particular course. Um, and this is an online version of my um, shamanic practitioners course, which normally runs in person. But if this year has taught us anything, it has taught us that we have to be really flexible. So this course came about actually by um, kind of by accident because Obviously, I had never any intention of teaching this as an online course. It was always an in-person course. But with the pandemic and lockdown, it had to be frantically moved to an online platform. Now, what's going on in the background at the moment um, on this screen that you see behind behind me here is just um, this is newly being newly created. But I obviously had to put things together quite rapidly. So there was a lot of Zoom classes and a lot of hastily acquired PowerPoints. So what I have decided to do was revamp everything. Um, I'm back in person teaching again, which is great. But there are some people who can't necessarily make it to classes. And there are some people, um, for whatever reason, whether they're shielding, whether they're not from my locality. Um, I've had inquiries from several countries. I have a girl in um, Morocco um, who wants to do the course of another girl in Panama who wants to do the course. I have a couple of other people um, in the United States and a couple of other people just dotted about the world who have shown an interest, which is phenomenal. And I find it fascinating that they've come to me. However, um, I thought to myself, there's no harm in putting this online anyway. There's no harm in having it online because what it does is it gives my current students a resource point and a, a revision point. So this will be given to my um, current students and the ones from last year so that they, they've got um, somewhere to look. And then anybody who signs up for the in-person course will also then be given access to this when they finish their course so that they can come back and have it as a revision uh, tool or a resource. Um, I'll give you a look just to let you see what it looks like in behind the scenes. So um, let me just get my face out of the middle of the screen. So it is a, um, I'll show you here. This is the, uh, the preview mode of it. So it's not finished yet. I'm working my way through it. And it's one of those things where I need copious amounts of coffee. So feel my pain, okay? Um, this is the preview of what you will see. So if you sign up for the course, this is what you get. Um, when you go in, you view into the modules and you can see then what is happening in each one. So because I'm in preview mode, it's a little bit more clunky than it would be in real life. But um, for example, these are all the lessons in module one. So that module one is the basics. So this particular module has also been made available. I'm running an introductory um, workshop to shamanism this weekend, uh, Saturday the 19th of September. and Obviously, places are strictly limited due to the current regulations. So there's quite a few people who want to attend, but who can't. So I have made this module available as an introductory standalone um, course that they can they can purchase for the same price as the workshop. And that way, then, if they can't attend, they can still uh, go through what we will be going through um, on Saturday morning. So um, things like what is shamanism? So when you click into each of the um, you click into the, the various lessons, you can see that um, there are videos, there are some text for you, there's things you can download and questions you can answer. And when you answer the questions, you submit answers and it opens the next lesson up for you. Um, or you can just click through them. I've deliberately, it should really be done as a progressive manner, but um, I know that people like to jump about. However, I do encourage people who are taking it to to move their way gently through it. Um, you know, so there's there's lots of various different pieces of information here. Um, so you can see down this side, uh, the Shamanic Basics is the first module in Lower World. Um, so if we go into Lower World, I was working on that one today. Um, so let me see, view this module. Is it going to let me see it? This is when the computer stops working. Um, so you can see that um, I have a video for it. I have some information 
and you can then move on to the next stage. Um, so I'm still working my way through it. It's one of those things you ever wish you hadn't started something. But I thought it would be nice just to give you a wee bit of an insight into what goes on in my world. So um, that's just something, that's just one thing that's going on. I have been overwhelmed at the minute with the amount of interest in Reiki classes. I don't know if everybody's had a spiritual epiphany during lockdown, but it's wonderful. And I'm amazed and really grateful and thankful that people are choosing me to be their teacher. Um, so I've had to put on two extra classes um, in October, which were so not planned. And they're both practically sold out. The first one sold out already. I think I have one space left on the on the other one. Um, on the 6th of October and the 28th of October, a Tuesday and a Wednesday. So um, that's happening. Uh, later on in the year, in November, there is a level two course. And judging by the number of people who've done level one, I may end up having to put on a couple of these to facilitate demand because obviously with regulations at the minute I'm restricted on the number of people who can come to the class. I have a level three class coming up as well which um, people have been very interested in and again so grateful for this because Reiki is wonderful and between Reiki and shamanism they are the two building blocks of my entire my entire business and my life so it's lovely to be able to share them with other people. I'm trying to think what else is coming up this month and next. There's loads, but um, I just thought it would be nice to give you an insight because I, I don't know about you, but I like to see behind the scenes. I like to see what goes on in people's lives and to find out what they're doing. Um, and I also just like to keep in touch with you, too, because I think it's important that, you know, you recognize the face behind the business. There's no point in just hearing about rocks and rituals and not knowing who I am. So it's nice to meet you. And if this is the first time I've spoken to you, well, how are you? It would be lovely to find out a little bit more about each of you. Let me know what your pain points are. What's going on for you at the moment? What's happening in your life? Because alongside all these training things, I also do see one-to-one -one clients as well and private sessions for healing, whether that is in person or by distance. Reiki, crystal healing, shamanic healing, that can all be done either in person or at distance um, with no loss of efficiency or um it, it works just as well, if not better. So, you know, if, if anything like that interests you, do get in touch. Coaching can be done in person or at distance. We can, you know, meet online or we can meet in face to face, whatever you want. Um, I take the COVID regulations and everything very seriously, obviously, because I am a professional. So there is a COVID policy online. If that concerns you about coming out, you can check that out on my website in the terms of service page. But, you know, at the same time, we have to get busy living here, guys. We have got to put our best foot forward, take sensible precautions and just get on with our lives. So if I can help you with that, please do get in touch. I also do tarot readings and giving you a wee bit of insight into what's going on. And as we approach um, October and coming up to Halloween when the veil is thin between the worlds, it's a brilliant time to get a reading done. So get in touch. Again, they can be done either face to face. We can do them over Zoom. We can do them um, over Skype if you prefer. We can do them over Messenger. We can do them over the phone or I can simply just you email me your question and I'll email it back to you. So if you're shy and you don't want to speak to me, that's OK. No drama. I get that. So anyway, that's just some of the bits and pieces. And I just thought it would be nice to give you an insider look behind the scenes. Get in touch. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. And don't forget all the information about courses, about services, everything you need to know is on the website, www.rocksandrituals.co.uk. But please do get in touch. Let me know how I can help you and let me know what's going on in your life and what services would be really useful for you. Okay, thanks very much.